What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. So Halo Infinite has released Season 3 Echoes Within and I want to go through the 100 tier battle pass with you so you can kind of see what you can get for both the free version and the premium stuff. So we're just going to quickly go through this starting off with the first slot here. So this is going to be a background that you can have for your backdrop on your nameplate. And then we got ourselves some... At first I thought these were basketball hoops. I ain't going to lie. I thought those were going to be basketball hoops. But there's stuff for your ankles, apparently. Uh, we got some shoulders, shoulder piece here. Challenge swap, another shoulder piece. Visor. Get yourself some currency, challenge swap. It's a pretty dope looking face. Chest piece, that's eh, not too bad. Challenge swap, another background backdrop thing. Challenge swap. Eh, I don't really care for that for the chest. Stickers or emblems. Armor coating. It's pretty basic. Another challenge swap. That's pretty dope. I do like this. That's pretty cool. Another armor coating. I'm a sucker for like bluish green stuff. That's like my colors. I love that. So this looks really cool. Another uh, XP. Or actually, I think that's our first XP. But then challenge swap. And then another emblem, stuff for your knees, which is not really that big, so you're really not going to see that. Another armor coating, that's not too bad. Still kind of basic, though. Currency, challenge swap. It's kind of cool from an angle, but straight on, it just looks... Ugh. But from an angle, it looks pretty cool. And then we get another emblem... XP boost, challenge swap, another basic, that's not too bad, I like that one, it's kind of like a mixture of what we saw kind of towards the front, but that's not too bad, kind of like that one. Alright, that's not too bad for our armor coating, another shoulder piece, okay, that's, I know it's basic, but that that just looks better. Like, green camo just looks better, in my opinion. Shoulder piece or arm piece. That's interesting. It's an epic wrist. Tax spike lantern. Hmm. XP, challenge swap, emblem, emblem. McDonald's colored armor coating. <laughs> Another challenge swap. Currency. Okay, so we're getting a duplicate for that. That's pretty cool. Nice little accessory stuff. Challenge swap, XP. That's okay for a visor and a helmet, I guess. That's not too bad. But yeah, this is a, I thought it, at first I thought it was just a visor, but it's the helmet too. The shoulder stuff doesn't really... I don't really care for the shoulder stuff all that much. And then we have a challenge swap. Another one for the other side. Emblem. That's pretty sick. Love the reflection. That's really cool. Challenge swap. XP. I like it. It's, it's kind of plain, but I mean, I like it. I like that weathered look to it. Emblem, challenge swap. Something for your wrist? Yeah. Project Deity Walk? I probably said that wrong, but interesting. Now that's pretty interesting. I don't know. It's just, I'm going back to this one. It's like. It, it gives me like Valentine's Day vibes. Like this would have been great for Valentine's Day for people to rock. But I mean, you know, it's, I would I would put this on some of my weapons if I if I could put it on multiple stuff. And then we got currency, gloves. Hmm. Never would have thought of that, but okay. Challenge swap, more XP, emblem. Okay, so this armor coating is, eh, it's all right. 
I don't know. The armor coatings I'm just not a huge fan of so far. I mean, there's a couple that we've seen so far that are pretty cool, but this one's me. Another challenge swap. We got ourselves a stance. It's kind of boring. I'm a sucker for the blue ones, man. This just looks really cool. And this is also on the newer weapon, too. The M392 Bandit. So I'm going to try to test that out and see how it plays. Okay. So the chest piece looks pretty good. They're, they're doing pretty better with the chest pieces. And then we got challenge swap again. The hell is this? It's like Doom Slayer meets pepper salt shaker in the front there what is this is kind of cool actually I, I might i might rock this for a little bit <laughs> it's just those front things like on the cheek area that look like salt and pepper shakers oh okay so when i looked at this armor coating i could see that it was gonna have texture this actually is pretty cool this is a good one we need more with textures to it I like this. XP boost, another emblem, I think. Oh, it's a nameplate. Hold on a minute. Okay, so I got that one right. Sticker. Sticker. <laughs> I'm making sure I wouldn't say the wrong thing for some of the other things. Sticker. 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 Right? We got we got all stickers. Yep, sticker. Uh-huh. Okay. I think I think we're good. <laughs> okay, let's go back here. Where's the funky salt pepper shaker face? There it is. Okay. So we got ourselves a nameplate, not a sticker or emblem or whatever. I know that I know I kept saying sticker, but they're emblems. They just it just reminds me of stickers. And then another challenge swap. Ugh, this ugly camo or coding. Okay, another emblem. More currency, another challenge swap. I like these. They need to bring some of these more. I like having the different like utility stuff. Okay, this doesn't look very good on the smaller one. Maybe in like game view, but just from looking at that, it's like meh, whatever. And then another XP boost, another challenge swap. Helmet, antennas. Okay, it's pretty cool coding. I like that. No, just no. Challenge swap. Ooh. That's cool. Kill effects. Nice. Another emblem. XP. Challenge swap. Another backdrop. Yes, we get to put it on an actual Spartan. I'm totally going to be rocking this one if I get this. And this is one of the free ones, which is really cool. Eh. Challenge swap, currency. It's so hard to see with the lighting that they do in this for this, but it's not bad. It's not like screaming so much pink as it did for some of the bigger weapon, but or bigger weapons, but eh. they really need to add some variety to these full face visor helmets. Another XP challenge swap. This boring generic. Okay, another emblem. That's pretty cool. I do like that. It's nice. Giving me some uh, Tony the Tiger vibes, but I like it. Challenge swap. Now well, we're going back to the arm pieces. Okay, see, I like the textured visors. Textured visors are nice. And this just goes on the other side. Challenge swap. XP. Another boring stance. Emblem. The gold coatings look really nice on these weapons. I do like this. It's a very clean look. Challenge swap. Currency. 
another emblem. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Challenge swap again, XP. That kind of weathered look. Could have sworn we just had this one not too far back. Challenge swap, chest piece. So the chest piece and the utility stuff is looking really nice for this for this uh, season. But I'm not digging some of the uh, the helmets or uh, the like like the arm pieces like this. Another stance. XP, challenge swap, another sticker, emblem, whatever you want to call it. Again with that, you know, more currency. Okay, so you can you can put this on the full Spartan, which is nice. Okay, so we got a free one again. The challenge swap and the XP. This is so interesting. So, like, at first I didn't think it was going to go all the way around. It just looks so weird. Like, the way that it bends. <laughs> I mean, it works, but at least it's a little bit of a variety that we got going on, but not too much. So, we can get so close to making a Doom Slayer outfit. You take this armor coating, and then you take the one that looked like the salt and pepper shaker, and then that's pretty close to it. Go ahead, another challenge swap. Okay, this is probably the only, like, I would say weak chest one so far that we've gotten. The other one that had just like the clip holsters that you could have extra clips sitting there, that one was kind of meh too, but eh, this one's kind of eh. And then we got ourselves another back plate for, I think, back plate and, uh, or name plate and like the backdrop for it. Otherwise, I mean, it just has name plate, but I think the background also changes on it too. I don't know. That's pretty interesting. A lot of XP and challenge swaps. Oh wow, they actually got a purple. Like, hardcore on the purple. This is cool. I like this. I would like to have seen this on some of the weapons. Hopefully we'd see a repeat of this one. So tired of seeing these emblems. They're so boring. Oh yeah. This is giving me like the Halo 3 Xbox 360 vibes with this. Love this. Okay, got some currency, a really weak knee plate or knee pad, more challenge swaps and XP, a name plate, just another boring urban coating. Not bad, not bad. Okay, shoulder piece is kind of meh. I mean, I don't really see much variation, but I mean, it just kind of covers the top part of the hand, I guess. So, but eh, it's all right. XP, nameplate, challenge swap. Well, that's trippy. Another nameplate, currency. Challenge swap. What the hell is this thing? What? What is this? Like, this is creepy as hell, man. Bugs. It's all I'm getting is bugs vibes from this. Of course, they would give this one for free. I mean, it's not bad. I like that it's got the purple undertone for, like, the, like, the suit. But, like, the armor is kind of, like, different shades of pink. It's kind of cool. I still feel like this type of color coding, though, or this armor coding, 
is just a little late. You know, this would have been nice for them to kind of throw in the store for uh, Valentine's Day and stuff. XP boost, challenge swap, chest piece. It's a pretty dope chest piece. I like that. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, is this got texture? Oh, that is sick. See, we need more stuff like this. This is cool. Challenge swap. Oh, God. Let's upgrade the bug eyes. Let's go back to... Hang on a second. So, we went from two eyes... to... How many here? Eight eyes. Jesus. <laughs> Okay, I could do with that. It's like a Spartan fanny pack. And then this is what the hundredth slot is. I mean, it's cool, but I feel like this shouldn't have been the hundredth slot. I feel like they could have chose something much better for this. But that is everything for the battle pass. Now, if you're wanting to purchase the battle pass and upgrade to premium, you can do it two different ways. You can do a thousand or you can do the 2800, which will give you 25 battle pass level skips and just kind of see how much that would cost you. If it will load, there we go. Okay, so if you want to do the premium battle pass bundle, which is 2800, you're looking at around maybe $30. Otherwise, if you just want to do the thousand and work your way from, you know, the very first one all the way to a hundred, then it's only going to cost you nine US dollars. So it's up to you on what you want to do. But yeah, I mean, that's the battle pass, guys. Um, it's it's not the best. It's it definitely has some cool things in it that I would like to have. So I'm definitely going to grind the battle pass, but I don't think I'm going to do the skip. I'll, I'll think about it. But I wanted to share with you guys. I want to get your, your own thoughts on it. So let's talk about it in the comment section below. Are you going to be grinding this season? Are you going to be buying the Battle Pass? Which version of the Battle Pass are you going to buy? And what is something that you are most anticipating to get out of the Battle Pass? Let me know in the comment section below. But if you enjoyed today's video, be sure to like it. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. And I will see you guys in a future video. Thank you again for watching and stay nerdy, my friends.